my biggest joy, I think, comes from sharing the arts with people. I think that when I, as a, as a young student, when I began discovering, you know, the richness of the visual and performing arts, I just felt I need to share it with everybody else. My professional goal was always to teach in a community college because I had such a great experience at the one that I attended in San Diego. So when I was able to begin teaching at Coconino Community College in 1992, it really was a dream come true. Um, so just last year, I, I retired from teaching at CCC after 30 years. In reflecting on this award, I thought about what I was going to say and what I was going to be asked and what I would be viewed as having done here in Flagstaff. I have to say, you know, my role on the Arts, Business and Culture Committee that led to the establishment of Flagstaff Cultural Partners and Creative Flagstaff, my role in the Flagstaff 2020 visioning process, the document that I wrote with Kate Sibley, the creation of a very vital art department in a small regional community college where we did everything we could to serve our students and to give them a, an invigorating arts education the creation of the Artist Coalition of Flagstaff, a community organization that's still going stronger than ever today. So those are the things that I think, that I feel very proud of. And I think it's really important to say that everything that I imagine that I'm being celebrated for here tonight couldn't have happened without the help and support of many, many, many people. And I'm so grateful to, first of all, to have actually had a successful career in the arts. But I'm, I feel very grateful to have been able to create these lasting institutions for Flagstaff in a community that I feel very deeply for and for all of my friends in the arts who I've shared so much with over the last 40 years.